It's a pleasant pastime with terrific side effects. The magic of a first kiss is something we don't soon forget. It can seal the confusing accumulation of contradictory feelings we have been harboring towards a person. A kiss can say, yes, I want you, and it does so without words. Within a relationship, kissing quickly becomes a ritual that augments greetings and goodbyes, but also the confirmation of mutual feelings in between. Some people even find kissing more intimate than sex. But it's not only emotionally that we top up our game when our lips touch that special someone's. Our body and psyche also benefit from this special kind of contact sport. In today's video, we'll show you 9 wonderful side effects of kissing. If you like our videos, feel free to support us with a thumbs up, subscribe to Psychology and Mind, activate the little bell, and get excited about the videos we upload for you every day. Number 1. Kissing Reduces Stress A whole host of hormones kick in when we kiss each other. One, however, is promptly and reliably removed from the field, namely the dreaded stress hormone cortisol. Kissing therefore calms us down effectively, lowers our stress level in a matter of seconds, and, with the cuddle hormone oxytocin, also successfully lengthens positive effects beyond the kiss itself. But that's not all. Other happiness hormones such as serotonin, adrenaline, and endorphins are released in our bodies during kissing. Our heart beats faster, our pulse, blood pressure, and body temperature rise. Our entire body is essentially thrown for a loop, but a very nice one. From a purely medical point of view, kissing lowers negative stress by fighting it with positive, and it does so successfully. Number 2. Kissing strengthens our immune system. Kissing stimulates our saliva flow to peak performance, and it is cycled through our mouth quite effectively in the process. This less erotic aspect of kissing carries a huge benefit to our health. Studies have proven that swishing saliva in and around our mouths makes bad bacteria less likely to stick to our teeth. Bacteria are essentially washed away during kissing. Our mouth cleans itself in the process. This also makes viruses less likely to attack our immune system during cold and flu season. Number 3. Kissing tells you in an instant if you're a match. The first kiss is the match. If it feels boring, mushy, or just plain meaningless, then it's a signal not to go any further. The fine nerve pathways in our lips, tongue, and around our mouth are something of a direct line to deeper regions. Primarily, they're a direct pipeline to our intimate area. However, our brain also receives a signal when we kiss. Ideally, it reacts with euphoria. If this does not happen, the chemistry between you is simply not right. We should calmly trust our body on this point. Kissing is not a superficial act nature invented for the continuation of mankind. It's a sign of intimacy, trust, and belonging. If these feelings are not reflected in your first kiss, there's no hope for them happening in the medium to long term. Number 4. Kissing makes us look younger A whole 34 different muscles move in our face when we exchange particularly intimate French kisses. This facial acrobatics ensures that the skin and tissue around our jawline become firmer and tighter. So regular exchanges of a special kind can, in the long run, not only make us feel younger and more vital, but actually make us look younger in the face. This anti-aging treatment is totally free and also a really versatile tool, as the other points show. Number 5. Kissing boosts our self-confidence A kiss is like a promise. Our partners use it to signal publicly that they feel a bond with us and that we have exclusive rights to them, so to speak. To the outside world, however, a kiss also represents the status of living in a relationship, which is still essential for many people. The feeling of being loved and desired alone is enough to make us grow inside. What could be more beautiful than being someone's chosen partner? A kiss seals a pact over and over again. Number 6. Kissing fuels our love life A kiss is the perfect indoctrination to erotic togetherness and tingling hours dedicated exclusively to lovemaking. As is well known, 
every form of touch strengthens the bond with each other, and sex is probably the most wonderful way to perform relationship work. Kissing acts as a teaser in this process. It makes our bodies want more and more of each other. The rest is in the nature of things and follows naturally. Number 7. Kissing makes us social beings. Kissing creates closeness, closeness creates trust. Where a climate of trust reigns, togetherness is automatically more conflict-free and harmonious. It's no exaggeration to say kissing contributes indirectly to the maintenance of world peace. However, this would require that many more people in the world spend time on this little gem of intimacy than on conferences, meetings, and pointless discussions. Number 8. Kissing lifts your spirits in real time. There's a reason we're in a heavenly mood when we're freshly in love. When we kiss, a real fireworks display takes place in our brain. But that's not all. Our body literally goes into overdrive with the release of the happiness hormones oxytocin, dopamine, and serotonin. Our mood can't help but literally go through the roof. Number 9. Kissing enhances bonding and the feeling of intimacy. Oxytocin is not only called the cuddle hormone, but also the bonding hormone. It is produced abundantly when kissing and suggests closeness, intimacy, and a feeling of familiarity. Also, as mentioned earlier, kissing is the perfect gateway drug when we want more from our partner and preferably right away. Relationships often fail on the grounds, among others, that sexuality has been pushed more and more into the background over time. In fact, in such cases, it is exactly the opposite. Due to the lack of physical intimacy, less and less oxytocin is produced by the body. Thus, we also feel less and less a sense of belonging to our partners. Kissing is therefore a simple but effective way to bridge erotic dry spells with possibly devastating long-term consequences. Today's conclusion, hooray for kissing. Actually, no one needs to be convinced about kissing. If there is a deed that needs absolutely no advertising, then this is it. Nevertheless, we should give kissing the special status it deserves in the context of a relationship. After all, every ritual helps place everyday life in a beautiful framework and make it special. A kiss is the best and fastest form of nonverbal communication. Nothing is capable of expressing so much without words as the gentle touch of lips on lips. There's even a distinct holiday dedicated to kissing. The 6th of July is considered the International Day of the Kiss. However, it is best to train and prepare for this year round and every day. That's it for today. Thanks for watching. Did you find this information helpful? Do you have experience with it? We would love to hear from you. Leave a comment below and let us know your thoughts. For more resources about mental health, self-improvement, and psychology, visit our website. You'll find the link in the video description where you can also connect with us on social media and sign up for our email list. Take care of yourself and have a beautiful day.